Greetings and welcome back to Miss Survival. And today is the day of the final assault and the final rescue. What am I talking about? Well, let's just take a quick look here. All right, so we are here. So what we're going to do is going to head down this road over here past the mill, which, by the way, isn't really done yet, which is the reason we haven't been there. There's some things scattered around, but it's not done yet. And we're going to head up this road to take on these bandits. Now, this is a tower. I know for a fact that there is a sniper in that tower. He made his presence known to me in another reality. Now, there's also some other things around here. I'm guessing there's a bunch of bandits. So maybe we'll get the high ground once we take out the, uh, the sniper. Uh, there's another tower over here. I have no idea what's in the area. We'll find out. I also don't know if there is another sniper in that tower. I will assume there is until that is proven differently. And then, of course, we have what's ever going on up here, which is probably going to require a lot of uh, firepower. All right, let's look in uh, real terms. So there's the first uh, tower. That has a sniper in it. We can't see him from here. I don't know if you'd be able to see him anyway, distance. Besides, obviously, you wouldn't be able to reach him from here. All right, here's the second tower. Right? And you can see, at very least, there seems to be like uh, one of those caravans you can't go into over there. You know, the trailer one. And then, of course, there's a road going all the way up to whatever is going on up here. I'm guessing there's going to be some serious fighting. I'm hoping there's some serious loot, too. And as I mentioned, the final rescue will be taking place up there. So let's get going with that. Oh, I did want to show. I did some organization in here. For one thing, I made this, and I stuck all of my canned food in there because uh, I wanted to pull it out of all the other little places that were around, right? Um, also, uh, I was working on compressing things. For instance, the uh, whiskey. I, it turns out I had a lot of it, and it's only really good for one thing as far as I know, and that is actually making Maltoffs, which is a little strange here because the Maltoff requires a whiskey, you know, the booze, but it also requires a bottle. But we already have a bottle. It's right there. I mean, is the booze floating in midair and we need to scoop it up and put it into the bottle? I mean, it already has a bottle. Why do we need another bottle? It also uses detergent and rags. So I'm thinking, you know, detergent, I don't think that's used for anything else too. So if I just make a bunch of Molotovs, it'll like get me, what you know, the value of the loot, but it'll also reduce the number of things I have. Ironically, I think that the bottle is actually the uh, limiting factor at the moment. So I may end up picking up some bottles for a change. Because I don't think any of them are good for anything else, at least at this point in the development cycle. Uh, so it allowed me to do a lot of cleaning up around here. So things are a little bit more organized. Also, I noticed I had a lot of rifles. So I just basically gave these guys rifles. Uh, not that you can actually see it, although I think that... The only one who was showing the rifle was Scott. See, she has a rifle. Where are you hiding that rifle? Never mind, I don't want to know. And I know you have a rifle. Where are you hiding that rifle? I really want to know. And where is... Okay, you're actually not showing it now. Why are you not showing it? You just ruined my entire thing. Wait a minute. Yes, I did give you a rifle. Oh, you now you're showing it. Okay, so I, that doesn't work with the ladies. Oh, hi. I guess you guys are swapping places now? Changing of the guard. Okay, let's just uh, put this to the test for a moment here. Uh, one, yes, she has a rifle, and she's not showing the rifle, so you're hiding the rifle. We'll talk about that later. Okay, so I think it's time to go, isn't it? I may not make it back alive. If I don't make it back alive, I don't need him. Could you kill him, please? Thank you. All right, so let's get out of here. All right, and of course, after this, we're going to focus uh, kind of hard on uh, building until, um, until more content is added, right? Uh, here's the thing. I said this previously. I got to get rid of that tree. Really, I got to get rid of that tree. Um, 
After doing this battle, we are going to do the loot respawn. I can't make the garage until I do the uh, loot respawn because there's not enough concrete and there's not enough uh, blocks basically on the map. So I, as I said previously, I felt I didn't want to do it until I'd earned it. And that means I have to take each base. So we're going to take this base and then we're going to be able to do the loot respawn. And I'm going to head right back to the construction site to get all of the... Um, oh, okay, I think it's this way. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Is it that way? Okay, no, no, it is this way. It's this way. I wish I could see the road. I should get a pillow and put it under my seat so that I can see. All right, and here we're making the turn. All right, and of course the garage is the big thing, but I am going to be making other things, like the tree house and a house for them. And then we'll see. Maybe we'll come up with some kind of a cage, you know, using the fencing that will allow us to farm the infected during those special times. We'll see about that. Um, all right, so this is the mill over here. Like I said, it's not really done. A lot of the buildings are like, it has an open door, but you can't go into it, and there's nothing. They scattered stuff around the outside, so, but I mean, that's just kind of boring. When it's actually done, we'll check it out. It's the same thing like the factory. We didn't go there because it's not done. Now, the town up north was kind of done. It had a lot of good things in there. That's the reason we went there. It's not finished yet. I can't wait for that one to be finished. That'll be good. All right. Um, why don't we just stop right here? Because I think I've already given away my position. All right. Now, I don't know what his range... Okay, down. I don't know what his range of seeing me is. Oh, hi. How are you doing? Okay. Stops down. There we go. I don't know if any of his friends saw that. All right. Let's go with the high ground situation. I'd like to try to pick off as many as I can with the bow. And uh, by the way, it is important to remember, I am not wearing body armor. It's gone. It was destroyed at the... Um, at the mine, and I have no idea if the mining helmet actually gives me any protection. Hold on a second. All right, I'm going to hold this in my hand until I feel I can switch to something else. Okay, one, probably a bunch. Same guy. All right. Can I get to... Okay, can I pick up that bush and move it over here? Because I don't really see any, do I? Let's see what we have here. Oh, right there. I saw one of them move there. Okay. Um, okay, a little bit too far away. No bushes. Let's see. Oh, hold on. Dead. He saw me. He was about to shoot. Okay, this guy seems to be aware that something is up. Don't want to squander my arrows. Maybe up there. A bush right here. Oh, here we go. Two. Three. Missed. 
Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. They're in the ground there. I saw them hitting the ground, so I'm going to try to remember where they are. Is he the last one? I'm not going to assume that. Oh, he's going all the way over there. Okay, yeah, just keep walking this way. Okay, is that them all dead? I have one arrow left. Please tell me that's a morning haze. I'm going over to where I saw my arrows hit the ground. Um, what is that? Oh, he's wrapped a chocolate bar. Oh, I think he despawned one of his friends. Okay, um, I really don't like it when that happens. <laughs> okay, there's one. There was another one right over here, right? Okay, the rest of them should be in the bodies. All right, I just in case, shoddy, right? Just in case any of them are alive, shoddy. I, I grabbed the uh, thing out of him. Give me my arrow. The Broccoli Gang. All right, I'm going to take that. Take that. Take that. I don't see any others around. All right, I want to check the bodies out. Give me that. Where? Okay, give me that. Give me that. Okay, here we go. Um... Just had the arrow a moment ago. Right there. Boom. And a carrot. Okay, well, these guys... Uh, these guys watched their health carefully, didn't they? Until I killed them, of course, because they're evil. They wanted to be healthy. They should have avoided being evil. All right. How many of my arrows did I get? I got five. How many did I have left? One. Which means I'm missing two. Unfortunately, a lot of them went off stray, so I probably won't find them. All right, let me check this guy up above because I killed him first and he will despawn first. Okay, and you have that. You don't have uh, another rifle. That would have been nice. Oh, 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 we see this. Okay, so uh, let's open this up. All right, and we have a code. I wonder what this is for. Okay, 3293. 3293. I'm going to forget that one. Unless, of course, I use it quickly. I wonder what that's for. Oh, that reminds me. Uh, scouting. I don't see anybody there. There's like a caravan, but there's also like a tarp over there. What about... Okay, that looks interesting. All right. I guess we're going to find out. Thirty-two ninety-three. I think that was it, right? I hope that was it. I better use it now because I do happen to know where it is, and it's right here. Doggy, how's it going? All right, so let's see about this. Thirty-two ninety-three, and that was it. And doggo, hello? 
Okay, is he a genetic splice with, like, I don't know, a spider? Okay, um, we're, we're not going to do anything more with Doggo. Uh, he's just going to kind of follow us around. Um, here's the thing. He uh, really bugged me out. Really, really bugged me out. Um, see, this is the second time I'm doing this because... Um, I was stuck in slow motion. Oh, wow, that's nice. That's some nice stuff there. I was stuck in perpetual slow motion. And then I foolishly thought, well, why don't I restart? Um, yeah, the problem with that is all the bandits were back again, and I was standing in the middle of them, so I died instantly. All right, we got a lot of good loot here. I'm going to have to move up the uh, vehicle, though, right? Oh, that reminds me. I took stuff out of here. Why did I do that? I should be putting stuff in here uh, because, after all... Uh, I'll keep the duct tape. It might be a stack. Uh, you can have that. You can have that. You can have that. Anything else? You can have that too. All right. Let's just pick this up. Uh, so yeah, it really broke the game for me. So I'm not going to interact with him at this point. I just saw something red over here. Yep, there we go. I did see that. All right, let's move the vehicle up. No more of my arrows available. All right, so what do I have available here for the future? Um, I have six, so I lost two. All right. I mean, if I went crazy looking for it, I might be able to find it. But the thing is, I do have eight carbon arrows, right? And when I do the loot respawn, I'm sure I'm going to get some back because I do know where I got them. Especially that wonderful place in the loop that had so many great arrows. All right, so um, let's get in and let's get up here. All right, so I'll sh I'll I'll basically show you what happened. At least happened to me. All right, is there? All right, stop. Oh, he's in the vehicle with me. Oh, that's so cool. I didn't know that. Okay. I was like, what was I hearing? Oh, I drove over you. That's what the bump was. All right. Let's just uh, hope that that'll sit up there because my history with that is not good. Hold on. There we go. Yeah, my history with that is not a good one. Uh, right. Everything like that is like that. All right. So let's just do a final look around. I did search you. Yes, I did. Oh, I didn't search the vehicles. I need to do that, right? Yeah, you notice I went right for the outhouse because there are magical things in outhouses. Right. Yeah, it's too bad I can't take this one with me, right? Yeah, I, I believe I searched that one. Yeah, that's what the one in my uh, tower should have been or could have been, I should say. Can I? Is there anything up here? I didn't even notice there was a vehicle there. Um, so it was a good thing I did that. All right, so let me just see. Oh, there's not much I can do with this, is there? No. Is there a trunk? Nope. All right. All right, someday when the sledgehammer works, maybe we can get something from that. All right, I don't see anything else around here. That reminds me. What if it fell off? It probably despawned by now. I was looking to see if he would drop another... Uh, hunting rifle or at least a broken one because it's so important having a spare sounds like a really good idea you know but unfortunately i don't see that all right do you see anything there boy all right let's go on in here he knows not to get into this one all right do you have anything i want a really crappy spark plug no thank you uh where is the other there's a vehicle there. There's another one over here. Right, okay. Oh, is that firewood? No, it isn't. Uh, okay. Getting some good ammunition here, too. My uh, my stock of uh, shotgun shells is being restored here, so that's a good thing. All right. Can I move up a bit? You can see a lot more now, can't you? 
See, if there was a sniper there, I would be shot right now. I'd be shot. All right, let's move up. Okay, door goes in there with me now. All right, let's move it up. Stop. All right. All right, get out. All right, let me just drop stuff off here then that I do not want on me. Am I hungry? Uh, not really. We'll just let that go for now. All right. Um, oh, actually, I took ammunition that I didn't want to take, uh, especially the hunting rifle rounds. But I did get more, which is very good. Uh, I don't need that. Take that, take that. All right. All right, let's see what we can find here. All right, I am going to... Yeah, there's no high ground here, is there? Basically, it's ventilating heads day. No. F I don't see anybody. That'd be a nasty place to put a sniper. Is there anybody here? Hmm. Okay. Um, shoddy. Okay, I'm stuck there. I wonder if it's actually done past this point. Okay, good drawer. I like it. Got that last one? All right. All right. That had ammo, ammo in it. That's okay. All right. Let's see if there's something here. Of course, if there is somebody up here, I may be moving into their line of sight. What's going on up here? All right, let's get to all the way to the top of the tower so we can see. Okay, there's nothing here. I wonder if this is actually done. All right, there was no items here at all. And the dog was at the first location. So I'm wondering if there is actually anything past this point. Or past that point, actually. All right, well, you know what? We're going to find out. Me and you, boy. All right, I need space so that I can turn. Okay, stop right about there. All right, engine off, I'm out. Uh, I am of the opinion there's probably nobody up here. Just in case. There's like 12 of them as soon as you stick your head up, right? Well, I mean, there's cars to loot. Anything in here? No? Alright, at this point, I think it's shotgun time. 
Okay, there's a tent. I'm not seeing any loot lying around. Uh, open? Nope. Okay, I'm guessing maybe this is going to be some really big encounter someday, but it doesn't appear to be anything yet. Maybe there'll be like a boss fight up here or something like that. I don't know. Uh, but I'm looking to see if maybe something is here. I'm not risking that. No, I'm not. No, I am not risking that. That sounds like a terrible idea. Hold on a minute. How do I get in there? Oh, I guess I just got to do this then, right? Okay, it doesn't seem to be climbable anyway. <laughs> it's okay because I had no intention of doing that. Um, be like some... Oh, oh, there's one little bug. Oh, you fall and you're dead. No, I don't think so. That doesn't sound like a good idea to me. Okay, well, I mean, the only things up here that I see are these, but they might be completely empty. It happens like that sometimes, right? Yeah, they're probably going to be empty. Okay, that was one vehicle. Yeah, there is just nothing up here. It's the same thing with the, uh, the factory, is that um, it has a, a vehicle in it, but it's completely empty. Nothing. So the, I guess they have to designate whether or not a vehicle is going to have loot or not. What are you? Anything over here? Nope. All right. Well, at very least, we get a pretty cool view here, right? That's not a guy respawning, right? If there's one thing I don't want, I don't want respawning on the way down. That would be annoying. Anyway, that's it. We have um, run the final gauntlet, and it turns out the first step of the gauntlet is the only one that actually had any difficulty to it at all. So what I think what we're going to do is we're going to go back. All right, so let's just uh, doggy hump in there. Is he in there? Yep, there he is right there. All right, and, and I got to be very careful, obviously, because that's a very steep cliff, isn't it? Yes, it is. All right, so we got everything. We did get a bunch of ammo which is kind of something I was hoping for. Uh, but what I was really hoping for was at least one locker. I mean, we got a box, but I really wanted to see like a red locker. I thought that would be kind of cool. All right, I don't think that there's any problems here. All right, so let's just get back to the tower. If I can actually drive straight. If I can actually drive straight. And we are home. And I'm sure everybody is going to be thrilled with our new friend here, right? Hey, Scott, check out the dog. He probably does more than you do. Rachel, we have a new friend. Okay, did he growl? Hopefully he didn't growl. Hopefully he doesn't, uh... Okay, what's going on? Okay, he's just learning the lay of the land. Okay, that's fine. Um, I, think, I think the dog is too scared to come over and see you. Where, where is he anyway? Okay, where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Hello? Where are you? Oh, there you are. There you are. Okay, so now I do have some stuff for him, um, but here's the thing. I know how well this is going to go, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to sign off now. But before I do it, we've earned this. I'm going to hit the loot refresh. This is the first time I've done this in this playthrough. We've taken all the bandit camps. At this point, it comes down to building. I want to build a garage. In order for that to happen, I'm going to have to respawn so the construction site will have all its concrete and its blocks again. Because otherwise, there's no way for me to have enough to actually build the garage. So we've earned it. Last bandit camp taken. Boom. Done. 
It won't have any effect, as I understand, around here because I am here. But at other locations, it should do that. So I'm probably going to take a trip over to the, to the construction site to gather as much of the stuff as I can. Hopefully, it's enough to actually do the job. And now for this. Okay, so I don't know what's going on, but I did get to that point where I beat everybody in the first tower. Turns out that's all there was. And I rescued him. What happened was I interacted with him and things went in slow motion and I got stuck. I foolishly came up with the idea of saving the game and uh, coming back. But of course, the uh, bandits respawned and I was machine gunned before I even could do anything. So, uh, yeah, I luckily I always back up my saves. Uh, so we're going to end on this. All right. Uh, e. And I'm going, okay, E, that's talk. No, actually, F is feeding, right? And we're going to feed him the dry meat that I have. And now I'm stuck and I can't get, okay, exit. Can I exit from this now? Okay. Now, you see what's going on now? Uh, yeah, this is what's going on for me here. I'm handing him the meat, and he's eating it. The thing about it is, I'm permanently stuck in this slow mode. There's no way for me to get out of the slow mode. And also, I can't exit this screen on top, too. It won't let me. See, now, now come the fists come out, right? All right, so here's the thing. Um, okay, can I just... Where is it? Try, trying to get out of this. See, I clicked that to try to get out of this, and it won't let me. See, I'm stuck in permanent slow mode. So I am going to have to avoid interacting with the dog, because otherwise it will mess up my game. I don't know why it's doing this. I've seen other people have no problem with this, I'm having problems with this. And as I said, I am in permanent slow mode and I can't get rid of this menu. And no, escape does not do the job. I can save the game, which is what I'm going to do. But uh, yeah, this is the reason I avoided it when we found him at the tower. And the reason I am not going to be doing any of this because, at least for me, it's broken. And the fix thing doesn't fix this. It fixes the dog in case the dog does something crazy or gets stuck or something like that. Um... So yeah, anyway, I think that's going to be it for now. So we're going to focus kind of on gathering and building in the future. There are things I want to build around here. The first and foremost is I want the garage because obviously we want to give her something to do, our mechanic. And another thing about it is I do want to soup things up. I may have to go out and get another flatbed. So I think I have enough to be able to make another vehicle. We'll have to see about that. I don't think it'll go in the other one. And besides, I kind of want to leave that one. I'm hoping that we can color them. Anyway, that's going to be it for now. So thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games because games are fun. See ya.